Yes, so Pate is ready to try the cinnamon rolls. So, like fully in Fiji. Toso, Viti, toso, toso. Let's go. No. How will you cheer with the Fijians? Toso, Viti, toso, samurai kirtu. everyone welcome to our new vlog so here catch it so my husband is behind the camera so we are ready for a new um, recipe uh, vlog uh, I think all the Fijians they know the lolo bun and this will be a little bit uh, similar to the lolo bun we just don't do that with coconut uh, cream we just do it like cinnamon rolls with a nice topping that will be so delicious so i will just let you know all the different steps so that you can do it by your own and believe me you will super like it as i like it because i ate these cinnamon rolls first time in the philippines i don't know if you know the coffee shop cinnabon it's so tasty so warm cinnamon rolls sorry and with a nice topping and some nuts on top. Oh, that's so delicious. Uh, yeah, just come with me. I will show you all the steps and then we enjoy this recipe together. Okay, let's go. Yeah, so before we start, I will just let you know the, the ingredients which we need for this recipe. So I would say that are just basic uh, ingredients which everyone has home. So we need, um, yeah, we'll start with some flour. So 700 grams of flour. Then we need half of this cube of yeast. This is fresh yeast. Then we need a little bit of salt. Then we need milk. That should be a little bit warm because it will be a dough with yeast. And guess what it is? Sure, my barista milk. So you cannot only use it for coffee. You can also use it for baking. Very, very good. So I'm just doing everything with my barista milk which is incredible then we need max and then 100 uh, milliliter of water so i already put some water here and here you can also see our rugby cup world rugby cup in france from this year then we need a little bit of sugar 70 grams of sugar sugar and 70 milliliter of oil you can use uh, for example, sunflower oils or wraps oil, but don't use any olive oil. This uh, the taste would not uh, be uh, that good. And for the frosting, so for the topping, we need um, 190 gram of brown sugar. I can show you. This is the brown sugar. Then we need 120 gram of butter. Um, and um, yes, and a little bit uh, zimt, which I will add later. And then for um, this is like for the for the cinnamon rolls, like for the inside. And for the frosting, we need uh, also a little bit of butter, 60 gram of butter, 120 uh, gram of um, uh, cream cheese. You can use whatever you want. I'm using Philadelphia now, and one small packet of vanilla sugar and some icing um, sugar, around yes, 100 gram. Okay, that's it. You can also check it uh, below in the description. You can find all the in different ingredients and yes, to make these uh, uh, to make these cinnamon rolls. Okay, so I will use my Kenwood um, kitchen machine, but you can also do that with your hands or with a manual um, machine. Um, so it's a very very easy uh, dough. So, but for me it's easy because I have the measurement here, so I can just do it straight on the machine. So first, I will just do the half portion because for us two, it's a little bit too much. So I will start with the uh, milk. So 100 milliliter of milk. Okay, sugar. And now half of, of this um, cube of yeast. So just make it a little bit small. So that's enough. So and then 
Um, I will heat the milk a little bit here, so I can also do it on the machine. Just put it on like three or four. That's enough, and then just leave it for one to two minutes, and then it will it will heat it, so that the um, yeast can melt. Okay, so you can see like uh, the the milk. Uh, uh, yeast and sugar is inside so the milk is already a little bit warm so we can uh, move on with the next steps so i just put everything now in so i will start with the flour it's 350 gram because yeah i just do half of uh, this recipe so 350 gram i what i like to do is i do not put like 350 gram straight in sorry uh, i put a little bit less so in case i can increase it like put uh, more flour in step by step because i like it when the dough was like really soft so the flour is in then i put one egg inside so and then um a little bit of salt what is very important is that you do not put the salt uh, straight in the yeast just put it uh, like on top of the flour otherwise it will spoil the dough and then we have our water so i just change the measurement to milliliter so we need um, 50 milliliter of water yes okay so and now i will start mixing it and then the last step i will put uh, the oil inside now i will start mixing it So and as you can see the dough is like is already a little bit mixed so now i put the the uh, oil inside so 35 milliliter for me i like it the most when the oil is coming like um, the last step so then i mix it again and then yes the dough is ready and then we can leave it for 30 to 45 minutes so that it can rise and then yeah the base is already done for our cinnamon rolls. So as you can see, the dough is ready now. So like it's really soft. What I like is always to like uh, after I did it in the kitchen machine, I just take it out and just like like um, do it a little bit with my hands. And you can already see it's super super soft. So yeah, that's really good. So then the dough is ready. Uh, what you can do is now what uh, you have to let it grow now. So like I was saying, like for 30 to 45 minutes. So what you can do is now you can like put it in the oven on 35 degrees. You can also do it like prepared already uh, one day before when you need it for the next day, because this kind of dough you always should eat it fresh. Um, so you can put it in the fridge and then do it tomorrow in the oven. It's also nice. It's working. Or you do it like I am doing, I just leave it here in my bowl, put it in the candle pan, and then just give a little bit like heat to um, to the dough. So um, yeah, I just put it on like two and now it's, it's a little bit warm from the bottom. And then uh, it can grow now like for the next 30 minutes. Yes, and then the dough is ready. Okay, so what I already did when, uh, while the dough is like uh, growing, you can already put like butter and brown sugar in a pot and then just let it melt. And a little bit of um, cinnamon. So I like to put a lot of cinnamon in but it depends on you how much you are putting in but we like it like Patty and me we like it when a lot of cinnamon is inside yeah so then just let it melt yes. guys uh, now you can see the like the um, butter with the sugar and the cinnamon is almost melted so this is fine just turn it off and then 
leave it for a few minutes so it should not be that hot anymore when we use it for the dough. And the next step is the frosting. So after baking, we will put this frosting on top, which is the taste is so good. So I already put like the butter, the um, cream cheese, the icing uh, sugar and the vanillin sugar already inside. And now just mix it all together. So the beginning is always a little bit hard, but then it's getting super fast because the sugar will melt and then it will become liquid here. So this is the frosting like we will put on top when the cinnamon balls are baked, the uh, rolls are back, uh, baked. Yeah, so this is perfect. Okay, just leave this in the fridge. Yes, and I will let you know when I'm ready, when the dough is uh, ready so that we can move on with baking our nice rolls and yeah just come with me and we move on together Bula Vinaka guys it's me Pateo so today for you Fijians listening out there nanta boso boso boka viti ni kwa na boso boso thava na kene mbale mbale ni nda bula ngi endo na honwa nda nga elei vaka ni vaka vinaka na kene isau Kato in domo. Can I walk a mother? Nabosa na kato. A can in balambale, Ninda rawa ika and anguli. Se ra waka vinaka and dona ka. Nandomo, a tilomikin and a kakana. Nisa kato, oya, a sa levu nakakana, sa levu talangana kana. Yan, Nandamoso soka vitinikua. Okay, so guys, welcome back. So you can see the dough like it's like the doubles volume or size now so yeah it was it was working with the yeast so we just take it out now and put it on this map i don't know if you have this kind of map otherwise i can really recommend it so then uh like in the kitchen it will be more clean and i like it when it's clean so i re can really recommend this map this is from sally she, she's a german um with uh yeah, great success. She started, I don't know, seven, eight years ago with her YouTube vlog or channel. And now she's already like, um, yeah, selling her own uh, items. So now we just roll it. Oh, this dough is so soft. It's really nice. really good so yes and make sure to put a little bit of uh, flour on the mat or where you're doing it so that's not sticky so so this size is already enough okay so next uh, we have to put this um, yeah, butter with sugar and cinnamon on the dough so just mix it properly so that they are not this so that's like the that's like liquid. So okay, now we put it here on the dough. And then you can just uh, put it everywhere in the corners. Just make sure to leave a little bit space here at the end so that the dough is sticking at the end when we roll it. But the rest just yeah, put it in all the corners and so on. Yeah. Yeah, so now you can see like it's everywhere, only here a little bit space. And then just roll it. So you can see it's a very, very easy recipe and um, yeah, so no matter if you're good in baking or not, this is like super easy for everyone. So now we just cut it into like um, rolls, 
Zack. Zack, I don't know, like four to five centimeters. And suck. So, and now we take like uh, something, a bowl where we can, which we can use also for the oven, and just uh, put it in the bowl. Leave a little bit space because uh, the cinnamon rolls will grow a little bit. So, and the last one. Okay, so, okay, now please cover this. You can use just a tissue or, yes. Then just cover it and let it grow. You can put it on a warm place or in the oven, like 35 degrees, as I did before with the dough, uh, like for 30, 35 minutes again, and then we can start baking it. So, okay, as you can see, I already, uh, like let these uh, cinnamon rolls grow a little bit. So what I will do now, I will put them in the oven so that they can grow a little bit more and a little bit faster. And then we can bake them after that. So just put them in the oven and then go on um, 180 degrees. So now the oven will heat. And then when the oven is heat, the buns has to be there 20 to 25 minutes. So when it's getting dark, like a little bit brown, the uh, um, cinnamon rolls, then they are ready. But I will show you later. Okay. So guys, we have half time now. You can see still, we are almost 12 minutes left. But this is wow, just super, looks super delicious. Yeah. Man, I can't wait to put these cinnamon rolls in my mouth and also to dish it to my husband. I think he will also like it. Because last time, guys, last time he told me that, you know, like like from the beginning, he was always saying cheesecake. Every feature we do not eat cheesecake, we do not eat cheesecake. Uh, and then he tried the German cheesecake, which I made, and then it was his favorite. Now it's already three years his favorite cake, and nothing else is better than cheesecake. And last Sunday we had these cinnamon rolls, yes, and then he was saying, boah, these cinnamon rolls are way better than cheesecake. Can you believe that? For me it was a big surprise. So, but you will see later when he will taste it. I can tell you that will be super delicious. I hope or I wish I could give you a little bit smell into your your mobile phone or your computer. I don't know where you're watching this video. That's yes, yeah, super delicious. Okay, just see now our Woo! cinnamon buns rolls are ready. So oh, the taste or oh, the smell is just super good. Okay, so now now what we have to do is like after baking when they are still hot like straight after the oven. You put this um, like frosting on top, just everywhere. Can't wait to put it in your mouth, huh, buddy? Wakandua. The mother. In the Fijian style, like everything is perfect, but we would add coconut cream. But when I tried this one, it's just like putting my favorite uh, cake into second place. So this is the best, my favorite cake so far. Okay, just like, cover it nicely. So, okay, and I mean, this is already super delicious, but like to make it more special, 
I will put now or add some uh, like nice flavors on top. So we have different uh, creams here from Kiki. I don't know if you know Kiki. Uh, Kiki is also like a German YouTuber with delicious uh, creams. So she has the Milky Joy. It's like Kinderregel. I don't know if you know that. Then hazelnut cream, that's very tasty. Like and strawberry and um, pistachio. And today I will use the uh, pistachio and put it a little bit on top. Whoa, mangana. If this is not lekker, yeah, Patty? Then I also don't know. So, and second one, or oh, this is a little bit hot, so I have to take it with this. What is that? This is the hazelnut cream. Hazelnut cream. It's also super lekker. So, hazelnut, guys, it, it also comes from Kiki. All these Kiki's creams. cream. Yeah. from Kiki so the shop we have it here in Germany but also we online. have strawberry you can also uh, buy this online yeah but I don't know if she is delivering it to feed you yes maybe just Australia New Zealand so oops, sorry last but not least put some nice nuts on top the nutty so that it has a crunch And then I can just stay, enjoy your nice coffee break. I will give something to Pate to try. Then you can see if you like it or not. So guys, this is ready now. And yeah, just to see for you, this is our lovely Fiji jersey. So who gave it to you? This is uh, yeah, we are supporting. We really are supporting our Fiji team in this rugby World Cup. So who gave it to us? A very famous player. Who was it? Sammy Randrandra. Yes, that's the right. Trailer. So super happy and proud to wear that. Uh, and yeah, because it's the World um, Cup at the moment, so that's why we are here totally in in in. in uh, yeah in just standing beside uh, behind the team and that's why we are wearing this nice jersey so okay i would like to uh, let patty try these nice cinnabons what a mangana if this is not tasty then i don't so know creamy. super creamy so you should eat it when it's still warm then the taste is the best what so that it can just shit. melt in your mouth melt in your mouth and with some cream. Yes. Okay. Okay. So just look from inside. But oh, that's nice, huh? Nice. Okay. Let's try it. Yes. So Patty is ready to try the cinnamon rolls. So like fully in Fiji. Toso, Vici, toso, toso. Let's go! Yeah. How will you cheer with the Fijians? Toso, Vici, Toso, Samurai Kirto! Tresu, Tresu, Laka! Yeah, we will show you next time when we're in the stadium and support yeah. our, our boys. Okay, try it, try it, if it's better than cheesecake. Okay, guys, first we have to say our prayer, say our grace, and. Okay, also, like. Uh, if you would know that we are a Christian couple and uh, we would like to before we try this delicious my favorite cake we would like to share you a Bible verse our verse for today is Proverbs 9 10 to be wise you must first have reverence for the Lord if you know the Holy One you have understanding So I'm so fortunate, I'm so grateful that I was chosen to do the food tasting for today. 
So to you all out there, I'm doing the honor to try this delicious macchiato. So what can you say about this food taste? The texture of the bun, so fluffy. Yeah, when you press it down, it's so fluffy. The taste of the cinnamon, cinnamon, the cream, the peanut that gives the crunchy taste, and also from the corners, from the sides of the bun, it's so crunchy. Mm. How mm. many stars? Mm. 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 10 out of 10. What so, can do a matinee lavo? Can you recommend it? Guys, you should try it. Try this. You can make it. You can try it first with your family. Let your family members taste it. I would recommend it like 100%. They would super love it. Especially if you have kids, they would super love the different taste of this cream, hazelnut cream and uh, cocos. You, do you put cocos? Pistachio. Or oh, pistachio. pistachio. Okay, guys, I will uh, enjoy, enjoy this last more. piece with the... Yes. Uh, and this is the rest, so we will take it later to our parents so mm -hmm. that they can also try it. And then, yeah, anything to say? Guys, I also have a, we have a favor. We know that a lot of you are watching and many of you know that I'm also an uh, individual artist. I have my own uh, band, which is Island Way. Can you please, I will put the link of my YouTube channel for Island Way in the description and below. Can you please? subscribe to my channel uh, right now i have 800 something i need to reach 1000 in order to continue to do more out of it and yes so that's the end of our vlog today we would love if you put a comment down below and like and share and also feel free to message us on our other social platforms social media platform Cornelia Klassen on Instagram and Facebook and also you want to put the Instagram and Facebook and yes my love you want to finish it? so and if you like this recipe and these uh, buns so I think on Friday I will bake again because we are going to the 40th birthday of uh, the wife of my brother yeah the, they have a big function there and I will make a cake I think with Maxi King Oi. I don't know do you know Maxi King I can show you maybe already a little bit uh, um, like in secret what I will tell you what I will do. So this is the Maxi King like super nice snacks. So yeah, if you like to to watch that nice video when I'm baking, just stay with us subscribe and like it and yes thank you so much and also don't forget to cheer for our boys and pray for our boys yeah because uh the game against georgia is on the this weekend this saturday and we wish the boys <laughs> well and guys if 100 percent sure fiji is through to the quarterfinal we will go and watch yes. and bring you another live vlog from the stadium all right, more